good morning, evening, afternoon, whenever <clears throat> you actually watch this. What is it with Israeli places in here? Anyway, Wednesday version of your geo guessing. We are device worlding again, as I have no excuse for the reason why I can't say words and I'm fighting off a sneeze. Give me a moment. I'm either going to do it or <laughs> I'm, I'm really fighting it. Hold on. Sorry. Uh, let's hit reset. Hey, Wednesday Geo Guesser, we are doing Diverse World. Uh, I toyed with maybe changing around the map again a little bit, but I uh, might do this for a little bit unless somebody has a suggestion for a map. And as I've said before, you have any comments or suggestions for maps you'd like me to give a shot to try out for a day, a couple of days, or a week, who knows? Or gets put into the general rotation of maps I usually do. Put them in the comments below and I will get back to them. Speaking of comments, um, this may have been the general, oh, I'm old, as I've said a couple of times. Uh, the Gersh Schaefer Conservatory. And the only time I've ever really heard of conservator conservatories is from playing the game Clue. And I don't know how much of a uh, like cultural penetration this this board game has in other parts of the world, other than just in the U.S. My uh, <clears throat> sister and I we would play board games all the time, and playing board games with her was always a pain in the ass. Uh, pardon this tangent if I've gone through it before, but I'm going to do it again. Where, um, we'd play Monopoly. But since she, she since she was the older sister, she had all the say. I'm gonna just guess we're in Jerusalem. I don't know exactly where we are because I nothing here tells me anything. I can't read Hebrew, so we're just gonna make do. Um, she was the older sister. She was in charge, so you had to do what she said, and it was no different with uh, Monopoly, where I had to on the board. Um. I was only allowed to buy specific sets of properties um, to the point where she had her name written on the ones she would buy and the ones that I was allowed to buy. And I bet you, if you're familiar with the game at all, I'm sure you're very aware of what ones she was allowed to buy and what ones I was allowed to buy. Uh, just a little hint. She definitely got Boardwalk and I got the first two real shitty ones which i can't remember the name of like mediterranean maybe but that was the gist of our games of monopoly anyway we play clue and she was the only other person that i mostly played board games with as a child and uh i never really fully believed whenever we play clue that she played legitimately because she always won <clears throat> She was always the maid. She was always Miss White. And I think I was always Colonel Mustard. Or Professor Plum. Professor Plum. Um, but, nope, she always won. Maybe it's just because I was a dumb kid and I was like, I don't know how to play this game. I'll just list off three things and never get it right. I don't even know if I actually won a single game Monopoly as a child. Uh, well, Monopoly and Clue as a child. Um, but anyway... Why the fuck did... Oh yeah, Conservatory. That was the only board game I knew that actually had that in there. What a dumb... Well, I guess we reached the end of uh, <laughs> that guess. I had no idea. I was too engrossed talking dumb shit. Uh, this feels Mediterranean. Uh, maybe Spain or Italy. This also could be Portugal, for all I know. I want to go right there immediately, but I can't right now. Anyway, how we doing on this Wednesday afternoon? Actually, no, Wednesday morning when this is being recorded. I'm doing this Tuesday afternoon. Kurdrit Oboni, Clodian Vrapi. So this is more Baltic, I'm feeling. This could be Albanian in this neck of the woods down here. It actually could be Turkey. Um, I'm in... Pretty good mood as far as the day goes. Uh, I was 
going through the, as I started way before, the discussion of, oh, I'm old, when uh, talking about that Cars, when I was just talking about the song. Oh, I thought this was a road bridge. This is a nice little village. I like this. This definitely has like a Mediterranean coast feel, but with these uh, type of rocks, I don't know off the top of my head. Uh, Hotel Muzaka. Uh, nothing here is giving me a like a vibe as to like the region. I'm not seeing like a little flag somewhere. Kofstama. No, nothing. Nothing's helping me here. When I was talking about what I thought was a pretty well-known song, uh, Cars, and I guess it wasn't. References that were made or implied or suggested, and it was complete miss on either of our ends here. But that's just me being old, and I don't think Beer of Tirana. Yeah, so this is probably Albania, or at least an Albanian. I don't want to say settlement, but just like little Albania, I guess you could call it. Because <clears throat> I know it's like with Macedonia, they have a pretty large uh, congregation, I guess you could say. Can I actually get up? I cannot. Uh, congregation of Albanians. Gorcia Bridge. Uh, I don't know. Anywhere in... Like, does, am I going to see Gorsia somewhere here? I've seen Golem. But I'll just, I'll just click here for now. Hopefully I can find a bit more information. Uh, let me take a drink because I need it. As whatever I was talking about quickly leaves my mind. Um, just more references of me clearly being older than I am. And, you know, it's just me probably being naive or just unaccepting being like I'm not that old but target audience is what it is or at least the people watching this are of an age Tehran Sinji Tehran uh Velish Velabisht Tehran is hmm maybe it's around Around here, but I'm not seeing any of these words. It's 122 kilometers that way. So we could either be on this side or this side. Hmm. I'm gonna click like here. Maybe we're closer to the actual like coast and up. I'm out of time again. Jesus, these four minutes are flying by. We were farther up north. No, that's where I guess. We were farther south. Here. Hmm. Okay, I'm not seeing Shin pop up anywhere here. Or maybe it was just, I assume that's what it said, and it really didn't. Little Blue Bell School. Seguku Kit. Tale. Is this another Kenyan? That's my guess right now, is we're in Kenya. We could be anywhere along here, I think. <clears throat> Hopefully come across a... Not a flag, but just a little bit more information to help me out here. Can I zoom in? On these are... No, I can't see that sign. What about this one? All right, we've got taxi, UAU, this doesn't help me. What do we got? Ernest Junior School, Kitale, Buzawulia. Oh, we're in Kampala, Uganda. All right, where is Kampala? Well, we're outside Kampala, I think. I'm just going to kick Kira Town. We're around there, maybe. And be at that. Uh, I'll just try to sum... This is a nice house. I'll sum up that. Things that I think are just general knowledge that I grew up as a kid and thinking that most people know this one song that was released in the 1979 may have permeated culture, maybe in other countries, but clearly hadn't. So I don't know if it's like just me not 
or just assuming, or maybe it's just because that's what I grew up with. I'm like, yeah, everyone around me probably at some point knows that song. It's not like if I talk to people, at least in this country that I live in, would probably know the song. Um, but yeah, people in Europe, and if I had to guess, since I still really don't have not not so much not demographic or like geolocated views like i if it just follows past history i've had um most of the people who watch this stuff are in europe so it's not that unusual to think that whatever gary whatever that guy's name is that car song i'm assuming he's american based he could be british for all i know didn't uh make its way into places like Sweden. But that's just that. <laughs> what a dumb conversation I've just had. Like I don't know what the hell I was trying to get out of that, but whatever. We're done with that. Uh I you know, I we're do they actually have like province no, we're outside Kampala. Like, is there, like, is this the actual, like, oh, these are regions. Okay, so <clears throat> I'm just going to assume we're around Kampala, but I couldn't tell you exactly where. What else? I almost got a panic attack and thought that I didn't unmute it again looking at the volume levels for Mike, but I wasn't talking, so it wasn't actually going to show up as anything. Paranoia, anxiety, will be the end of me. Let's see. El Top Academy. A lot of schools around here, though. Registered by Mo and Sports. What? That's a interesting leaves on that plant. Just sound like an old person. Oh, look at that tree. It's so nice. I want to be back here. Thank you. Um, let's see this sign. All right, maybe this is actually going to tell me a bit more where we are. Cal, no, we were okay. We were farther south. Is this showing up? Not really. Okay, pretty good score though, at least. Feeling confident about where we are. Get off the screen, please. That seems to be a road sign that I want to see. Uh, I can't tell what these are. I was like, oh, maybe they're all weed plants, but clearly not. It's another thing I'm trying to... Stefano Dick. Uh, come to, it comes to terms with is kind of a strong word for it. Just like adapt to is... Uh, okay, is this Italy or is this France with all those long-ass bridges? I want to get hopefully to a roadside somewhere. Um, yeah, in like the past year or so, Autostrada, that feels Italian to me. In the past, yeah, in the past year, our state has legalized hemp plants, you know, cannabis plants, all that stuff, A20. This could also not be Palermo. Where is Palermo? Isn't that a... I feel that it's Italian. Well, yeah, legalizing plants, and they started growing them all over the place, and it's, okay, Palermo, A20. It's E90, but that's A20. A19, is this A20? Let's get a little bigger here and try to find it. Man, this is bugging me that I can only find A19. Is that the only What is happening in my mouth? E90. Man, all right. Fuck it. I'm, I'm annoyed. Anyway, driving around the roads and you... Like, right outside the town I'm living in now, it's it, they got this massive area of just nothing but weed. And you just sit there and drive. And you're like, there's just weed plants everywhere. And it's like, I feel this should be illegal, but it's not. It's just... Coming to terms with the new reality. And it's not like, oh, I think it's wrong. It's just like, oh, yep, we, we passed the law. We all voted on it and agreed on it. Now it's just 
oh, this is something I'm not used to seeing. It's just weird seeing giant fields of it and, you know, being fine with it. I mean, all the time it used to just be like corn everywhere, and I've always wondered why. Fontanaza. Are we like here? Like Fontanaza. Why am I not finding A20 anywhere? This is driving me very upset like. Let's zoom out and try to find this goddamn thing. Is it? It's not here. It's gotta be here. But I'm not seeing it anywhere. But, you know, seeing cornfields everywhere and you're just... <clears throat> I'm just going to click here to have me have something. A20. God damn it. Why is that, like, highway system not showing up anywhere else? Are we here? No. And you just stop on the side of the road and everyone buys corn. There's, like, the honor system thing. If you're not, like, aware of that, it's just, like, they'll put the food out and they're, like, in a little box next to you. Like, hey, help yourself to whatever, but, you know, please leave, like, five bucks or however much you think you want it, to. It's worth buying this stuff. And... Smaller towns, that works just fine. Other places, you know, they could take advantage of it, but they do it until it's, yeah, I think I was pretty close, but fuck, if I could not. It's just called E90. Is there, like, there's probably another one of those, like, at some point it was A20, but it didn't update in time, you know, kind of like what it did for some of those Russian highways. Okay, this is maybe Hawaii. Yeah, this is 100% Hawaii. Let's see. Can I figure out more? Hawaiian plates. Well, maybe these signs up here might have something. Although they blurred out that far ahead. Maybe it's... Uh, not Yukimura. Well, there is a large Japanese... Um, demographic in Hawaii, so this very well could be that. It also could be many other pla uh, places in the South Pacific. We're in a cul-de-sac, so that wasn't helpful. Let's see. Let's go this way. But how... <clears throat> Again, I needed to finish that sentence just for my own sake about the honor system of the corn, but uh, like people just grabbing ears of corn and then bringing it home and just eating it. You know, there's so many oceanic time warners. So, ah, uh, this has got to be Hawaii. And I wonder if people can just like in the middle of the night walk out to the middle of like a hemp field or a weed field and just take a bunch of them. I mean, yeah, it's shitty and people really shouldn't be doing that, but. In such a massive field, I'm sure they could call it like just a the the uh, a loss, really like from crops or bugs or whatnot, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, that was real important that I needed to finish that. But I'm trying to bring some level of coherence to whatever the fuck I'm talking about. And a lot of the time, if I listen back to the anything I done in any of these videos, I would just be so mad and be like, "Fucking finish a thought." Put some more effort into this, but I digress. Let's just look at Island Girl, probably is what that says. I'm finding nothing. Oh, I almost thought this was another cul de sac. It almost is. It fucking is. Please don't litter. Don't worry, I won't. Let's see. Okay, I am like trapped in here, and it's very unfortunate. We're going this way. Get me... Okay, got a minute 29 left. I gotta keep an eye on time here. Before I... Uh, Kula Ma'u. Ma'u. -u. Like, I don't know how you do the apostrophe with the same letter happening twice. There's a lot of islands. I mean, if I was to bet... I mean, is... is this the most populated island? It could be. I mean, this is the largest. But, 
Ah, get me on the road. Well, get me over here. I mean, this also could be a uh, steel plate ahead, midway. I don't know if they have that steel plate thing in like other parts of the world, but whenever they're doing like road construction and they're doing like <clears throat> pipe work underneath the road, they'll leave a big giant open hole in the middle of the road and they'll just cover it with a steel plate, which is, you know, got to be like two ton, half inch or inch thick plate of steel. And I'm just like, the second I drive over this, I'm going to either fall in or my car's going to get destroyed or something. Water. Okay, maybe this will tell me, like, uh, County of Kauai. I don't know which one's Kauai. Cow oh, man, I, if I had some more time. Yeah, Kauai. I just ran out of time. What a video. I feel disoriented. Like, I don't know how I got here 29 minutes and 21 minutes and 25 seconds from now i hit record and ended up here with not a bad score but a little aimless today feeling good though it was a good day today it's not over yet i got some more work i gotta do after this is done but for your case your wednesday is now good to go Either it's beginning or ending, whenever you watch it, I appreciate you watching it. And if you could, like, favorite, comment, subscribe, give me any of your comments, questions, concerns, complaints, anything at all you want to put in the comments below, I will look at them, I will read them, and type out some sort of gibberish, because it's very important you hear a middle-aged man give you his thoughts on whatever you post. Weird world we've got so far come back on uh, Friday to wrap up this week. I'll give you the blessing to go into the weekend. Thank you all for watching. We'll see you next time.